Hi, Ant here again. Okay, so in this screencast, we're going to look at bringing an a cappella, that is a recording of uh, just the vocals from a song, uh, into our session and see how we can sync everything up, okay? Now, the way we're working here is, from previous screencasts, I've got this boom beat and some percussion in structure. Um, often, if you were doing a remix, you may want to sort of find the tempo of the a cappella first and get that run into the click track before you start putting anything else on. But you don't have to, but that may make it easier. At the moment, because everything we've done is a, is programmed, so it's all just MIDI notes uh, or patterns in boom, and whatever tempo we set the session to, they will follow that, then that's okay. We can get away with it in this instance. So just be aware of that, okay? So I'm just going to go to Pro Tools and zoom out a little bit. Uh, and I'm going to turn the grid on there because we're going to be needing that. Now, if I go to the Finder, I've got a an a cappella here, which I want to use, okay? I know no rules. I know you know fools. We're in love with a beautiful game with no shame. That's cool. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drop this, drag and drop this into my session. Okay, so. I'm going to focus on this track for now. Okay. So, I know no. So the first thing we need to do when we want to sync up an acapella is we need to find the downbeat. Okay, so we need to find the part of the vocals which is on the one of the beat. Okay, so uh, if I just play this through a little bit. I know no rules, I know you know fools We're in love with a beautiful game with no shame That's cool, true, we jump in the queue Complete type brothers with a P-time tools So, if we listen to the start of that I know no rules I'll just count along with it. It, it Sometimes it may be hard to tell If you don't know the original track Or you don't have the full version of the original track in front of you You may not know But in this one, it's fairly easy to tell Okay, so it goes I know one, no two, rules, three, I know you know four, fools We're in five, love with a beautiful six, so, it's no, I know no rules. I know no. So that no is our downbeat, okay? So that's our bar one, beat one, at least for the purposes of sync. So again, using tab to transient here, I'm going to tab until I get to that no. No, no rules. No, no rules. So I know that is our downbeat, okay? So what I'm going to do for now is I'm going to put a sync point in there and we do that with region identify sync point although we can also use command and comma okay so you see here is put this little marker and that basically just means whenever we move this track this region from now that little marker will snap to the grid okay so that is going to be very important later so I'm just going to click back the cursor to that point. So that's our downbeat. No, no rule. So I'm going to put a marker, a, a identify beat marker, a bar beat marker there. Okay, and we do that in uh, event identify beat, or we can use command I, which I'm going to do. And I'm going to tell Pro Tools that is bar one beat one. So I just type one, and we get bar one beat one there. Okay. No, no rules. I know you know. So, if I just zoom out again, see now you see what's happened is that it's moved all of the the MIDI parts that we had programmed already to there because we've told it it's bar one beat one, but it's not in sync. If you listen, no, no rules. I know you know fools. We love with a beautiful game with no shame. That's cool. So it's actually still a different tempo. So for now, what I'm just going to do is I'm going to mute those drums no no rules i know you know fools we're in love with a beautiful game with no shame that's cool true we jump in the queue complete type brothers with a p time tools can't hide so we need to find one or two maybe even three or four bars okay so let's try and find two bars no no two, rules three, i know you know four, fools we're in love with a beautiful two, game with no shame four. that's cool so it's where cool where the singer says cool so let's find that that's cool that's cool. 
go so I've tabbed along there go go tr go true go true so that is the beginning of the third bar so we've got two bars and then that is bar three beat one so I go command I once again and then I'll just type three and it'll go bar three beat one and now what has happened is if we go back to where we had our downbeat you'll notice that it's changed the tempo and it's telling us that the tempo for those two bars is 117.6889 now that's a pretty obscure number so uh, there are different ways you can approach this you can round that up or down because it won't always be perfect if you don't have any rhythmic parts in the acapella that you're measuring so I'm just going to remember that 117.6889 and I'm going to option and click on that that tempo change sorry that bar beat marker okay I'm going to come out and I'm going to move that all the way back to the start so you see all our MIDI parts have gone back to the start as well and then on the tempo track here I'm, well, I'm going to press return to go back to the start of the song and I'm going to click plus to add a tempo change and I'm going to round that down to 117 okay so that means our whole track now is running at 117 BPM so I'm going to turn on the click again zoom back in on our vocal track okay and our sync point is still valid so I'm going to snap our sync point to the beginning of a bar and just listen to it with the click. I know no rules, I know you know fools. We're in love with a beautiful game with no shame, that's cool. True, we jump in the queue. Complete type brothers with a P time tools. Can't hide, caught offside, down with the art and the pride. I know you got soul, I know you can eat my goal. But sass me a grant you. I've been told in the nick of time, pick a time, pick a fine rhyme, sick of mine. Giving up the possibility to resign. Making out I know something you don't. Make so that sounds in time to me. Now I'm going to go to the end of the a cappella to see if it's still in time, just to make sure it doesn't slip out. Eat my okay, so that's running in time. So we've got that. That's 117 BPM. So that now will sync up to our beats. So. <coughs> so if I sync that to the beginning of bar two and we run from the top I know no rules, I know you know fools, we're in love with a beautiful game with no shame, that's cool, true, we jump in the queue, complete type brothers with a P time tools, can't hide, caught offside, down with So there you go, we've got an acapella that runs in time with the beats now. So in the next screencast I'll come back and show you what else we can do with this, how we can change the tempo and get the acapella to follow that. Okay, thanks for watching.